How does Yoshi feel when he takes damage? Dinosaur. Like if you laughed and subscribe for more jokes like this. And now, on to the devlogs. Game, Game Dev, Dev journey. journey. Just Poncho is making a Metroidvania called Moon, which is heavily inspired by Hollow Knight and Metroid. The video is really well put together, and you get a real sense of just how the game is starting to take shape. We are introduced to character creation, player movement, level design, and creating a weapon. This is a channel worth following, so go on, sub to Poncho now. So what's it like to try and be a solo indie dev for a year? Graham of Legend will tell you all about it in his latest video. And he has great advice for us, because this is exactly what he did. He's been a full-time game developer for a little over a year, and it's been a great experience, but of course not everything went to plan. Graham has five pieces of advice for you when you decide to make the jump. Maybe you're thinking of starting your first indie game. If you are, you'll want to check out the latest video from Philip Mars, because it's all about how he started his first indie game. Philip is an incredible artist and has made some really amazing 2D assets, which you can see demonstrated in the other videos on his channel. So make sure that you check that out as well. Great games have memorable boss battles, and so adding a boss to your level is always a big decision. Isto Incorporated has a video out which is all about adding a giant boss to their indie game. In it, you'll see all the planning and preparation which goes into developing and adding a new boss. There's a lot to enjoy and learn from here, so make sure to watch the full video on their channel. Finally, Zaves explains why you should not set out to build your dream game as your first game. This is advice which we've heard before, of course, but some of the reasons are a bit different. The really cool thing about this devlog is that it's paired with a blog post over on Medium, so be sure to check out that as a companion to the video. That's all for this week. Thanks for joining me, and I hope to see you all again next time. Thank you.